In this social networking video, we're going to be looking at Gather, which is www.gather.com. And the reason why we're looking at this social network is a great way to get your content on the web and having people follow you. And at the end of the day, if you're looking to get the social traffic, this is a great way and a great combination within one site. You can share ideas or comments or obviously write about your niche market with articles you can actually publish an article on the site you can also publish images so you can upload images which is always a great way of pulling people into your niche and then also videos as well if you want to now add video within gather.com you can add your videos as well and get people watching your content and ultimately getting back to your niche site as you can see here from Alexa.com, Gather's got a rank of 9,884, so it's within the top 10,000 websites on the internet, and it's growing all the time. So the features that you have with Gather means you can upload articles, images, and videos. You can join groups. You can invite people. And a great feature here is you can invite people through your address books, which is making it easier and easier for people to be adding their friends. So it's a great time to be getting in now and starting to use this service. As you can see here, we've got join today, it's free, so you can just join and sign up um, to get an account, and so we just hit the join button. And then we just need to go through adding our first name, last name, location where we are, create a username, password, confirm your password, email, and then you need to put in the verification word here, agree to the terms and conditions, and hit submit. As you can see, once you've entered your details, it says thanks for registering to activate your account, confirm your email address, and it basically sends you an email and you need to confirm it within seven days, otherwise your account will not be set up. So just log into your email and confirm you want to set up your account. Once you've confirmed your account, they take you through the next steps, the basics. They put hometown, employers, college, you can put the information if you want to here, or if you want, you can just skip the step and move on to your favorites. Um, and then email tools and photos so here you want to put in um, your favorites so lately what you've been listening to what you're currently reading last movie you watched your must-see show any interest and activities that you have and just separate them by commas and you can put that in here as well Then here, as you can see, the email tools, you can receive a notification of email and you can tick the appropriate box. So if someone pings your profile, someone comments on your content, if you receive a private message, you could also say if you get an invitation or a friend request, you can click whichever box you want. Keeping up to date, you can send me emails about gather events, contest news and updates and details. Or again, you can skip this step or just save. And then the next step here is the cause of photo op. You can just browse and upload a photograph uh, to be using as your icon. And once you're done, you just um, save and finish. Once you've gone through setting up, you'll be at My Gather, where you can check out your friend feed so you can see what all your friends are doing once you've added them here and their activities. You can go through the group feed, and you can even do the feed me where you basically type in keywords, and it will then bring you relevant content. If you want to invite your friends, and this is a cool feature here, which will be great once you have other people coming because they'll be inviting their friends through this method, which that means they can import people from their Hotmail account, their Gmail account, even through their Facebook profile. They can manually add email addresses, or they can even search search um, uh, other email clients like Outlook and Exchange. The great thing about this, of course, is as people invite more of their friends to gather, and if they are um, using your social network, or they're looking at your products or your sites and your images and your photos, then they're more likely to refer those people as well and have more traffic coming to your site. As you can see here, we've got group feed. Once you've joined a few groups, you'll see the information showing up here. It'll keep you in the loop of what's going on. You can even create your own groups, which ultimately is what you want to be doing, getting people into groups and following what you're doing. So as you post more content, they're notified of what's going on. And then there's also Feed Me. And from here, you can actually search for other material and groups within Gather. Just to give you an idea here of what I mean, I just typed in cooking as just one keyword and hit save and it gave me an update of different topics um, and posts from people related to cooking. So if we went to, for example here, cooking help needed, someone's just asking a question um, about how to create something, I think it's a gravy in this case, we could post comments um, as people have done here and then ultimately it linked back to us as well as you can see here, someone's put a reply here. 
and straight away you could go to their profile and see information about them. So it's a good way, a little bit like with Yahoo Answers, it's a way to answer questions, but also you could actually write articles and contribute here actually helping people um, finding certain information that might want this have been in your particular niche and that way you can become well known and people will then be using or looking for information from you and ultimately going back to your websites once you've then set up just go back to your profile and from here you can add a photo you can put a tagline here you could put basics about yourself so you could point to your website your friends and groups will show up here People can ping you here. They can read about um, affiliations. Like, can add your schools, your jobs, what interests you are. So, again, want to make this more relevant to people. At the end of the day, the more interesting this profile page is about you, the more likely is people are going to be taking notice, joining your groups, and reading the content that you post about. If it's a blatant sales page, then people are probably not going to be so interested. Um, what you want to be doing here is showing the interest in your niche or even having other people write or put content on here for you that establishes you with the credibility in your niche market. If we were to step through each of these at the moment, like I've just shown you here with my articles, images, videos, comments, it'll all say nothing is to display because you've got not done anything as yet. So the first thing you need to do is start to getting involved and either publishing and uploading some videos, some images or some articles, or going and looking at some groups and perhaps taking part in some conversations and having some information posted on there. But the first thing I recommend that you always do is get that profile page up to scratch first with all relevant information about you. Sit make show that you're a real person have a photograph on here don't just leave it blank um, with a default outline silhouette like we have here but actually upload a photo that's maybe relevant to your niche or a good picture of you that shows you associated to your niche market and you can have that on here so if you like fishing you could have a fishing rod or maybe you fishing if you're a chef or a cook you might have you in the kitchen cooking something uh, if you're a fitness instructor maybe you working out in the gym or at least a photograph of someone doing that to give it make something specific so again it associates with you straight away people recognize the photo when they come to your profile and then just make sure you've got good information in here videos are still quite a new section to gather as you can see there's only 1600 videos on here at the moment so using this medium and uploading good quality video content will be a good way at this stage to get noticed as well um, as i said we've still got a low amount of videos on here so if you start uploading good quality videos related to your niche this will be a good way to get noticed within gather the great thing about gather here is once you go to publishing so we're at the publish section you can even walk through how to publish how to publish an article or images or video you've got helpful guides down the right hand side here and like here just to create an article we put the title the body we can add images if we want to tags we can allow rating and comments if we want to let people comment them or rate them and we can also say who can view the sections you can make it private or your group or everybody you can add it to your groups and you can publish it to different groups as well and the great thing is anyone who's in your group when you add content they're automatically updated about the latest information so that's how simple and easy to get signed up together to start sharing articles, images and video in different groups. And as you can see here on the essentials, the main topics that are discussed within this site at the moment are writing, travel, politics, news, music, movies, money, health, food, family and as hey any as well which is basically entertainment and also books so if you want to start gathering and adding your information just go to www.gather.com and set up your account today thanks for watching